Hi everyone, my name is Izzy and welcome to my channel. This is my first um, video, so apologies if it's kind of bad, but um, this is going to be a Thailand haul because I'm going on holiday to Thailand next week and I've kind of grabbed everything that I'm going to be taking um, in terms of like clothing and stuff wise and I just wanted to share it with you because I've bought um, quite a lot of this stuff pretty recently and I love everything I'm going to be taking and yeah this most of this stuff is what is currently in stores right now so if you want to go and get it you will still be able to get it so I'm going to stop rambling in this intro and I'm just going to get on with the video and those fingers didn't go the right way. I'm gonna get on. So I'm just going to be grabbing stuff from this ginormous Everest of clothes I have in front of me. And the first thing that's on here is a hat. And this is from H&M and it just looks like this on. It's just got a kind of that kind of straw hat thing. But it's not like a straw hat. And it's got a black um, band around the middle and it's kind of got like a little bit of a bow there and I just think this is really nice and really appropriate because I don't want to be getting sunburnt on my head. So the next thing I have in this pile is a um, new swimming costume and this is from H&M and this is a bikini and um, it's really bright and funky so hopefully the camera doesn't just explode from the bright colour and it is this bright um, orange colour and this top bit's pink, I don't know if you can see, and this goes like around your waist as like a separate little bit like that and the top looks like if I can hold it up properly, the top looks like this and the um, there's kind of like a pink border again and that bit hanging there is, does not go around your neck, it goes like around your stomach and I just think that this is really cute and really kind of um, holiday and this was from H&M. Uh, the next thing I'm going to be taking is this kimono which is ah, which I did not buy recently. I bought this um, last year and this was from Hollister and it's just this really really thin silky material and the sleeves are really wide and it's just super thin and I just thought for Thailand which has a really um, humid hot climate and it's really flowy at the bottom as well. I just thought this would be perfect to kind of just throw on on top of a um, basic outfit and it kind of flows out like that and I am just obsessed with this and I've had this for the longest time and definitely worth the money. Next thing I have here are these pair of shorts which I have had for the longest time and they've been sitting in the bottom of my wardrobe for the longest time and I'm pretty sure this is the front and they're these just black high-waisted shorts from New Look and I bought these at least like a year and a half ago and they've been sitting at the bottom of my wardrobe and I've just kind of forgotten about them and I pulled them out and I was like oh this would be nice for kind of evening time again sticking with the shorts and you know not like long trousers because otherwise I'm going to be boiling and I just thought these were really nice and they're just plain black and they have like a zip on the front I don't know if you can see if I kind of zoom in a little bit like that so the next thing is something I bought um, just yesterday and this is from Matalan and Matalan is not usually a shop that I go into because I thought that the kind of kid section was more for like 10 year olds and then the adult section was for like kind of mum age kind of stuff, not trying to be funny or anything but that's just kind of what I thought. But I always knew they had a section for like teenagers but I always thought you know it was a bit that like embarrassing teenage stuff but I found this which I am obsessed with and it is this t-shirt and it's got um, slits on the side and it's just this grey material with black freckles and it's got a black neckline and it just has rose gold writing on it and you can see what that says so I'm not going to read it out I'm not going to insult your English intelligence and um, that's rose gold with like a black background and I thought this would look so nice with those black shorts or with some black leggings and this is just a kind of longer t-shirt but not too long and it's just super comfortable and I got that in uh, age 14 even though I'm 15 you know don't always have to go again go with the rules and then I got these also from Matalan I know right um, white denim shorts and um, I got this in a size 16 and it's kind of frayed along the bottom and there's pockets on the back 
and take it from the front obviously and it's kind of got a bit of distressing here I don't know if you can see a bit like ripped at the front but I just thought these were so nice and these are really comfortable they don't like give you a wedgie and um, they're just really comfy and I thought these would be nice for just everyday evening whenever whenever with a crop top would look really nice so um, I'm also going to be taking obviously a pair of black leggings and you can get these from anywhere so don't stress about getting them from New Look specifically which is where mine are from and this is a size 10 by the way but these are just your average black leggings which is nice got to take some of those next thing I got um, you can't get anymore so I'm really really sorry because I got this like three years ago and this is from Topshop actually my grandma bought this for me and it is this beautiful kind of crochet thing uh, crop top and this is from Topshop Petite and this is in a size UK 10 by the way and the bottom bit is just beautiful it sort of hangs over and it has like an inside layer if you can see so it's not see-through which I love and it's just it's just my life so the next thing is something I bought recently so you can still buy it and it is this jacket from H&M and I don't own anything like this and I thought it's about time I did and it's just this kind of camely beige color I hate I hate the color beige but this is it's okay on this and it's this jacket and it's like a long jacket and um, it's got roll up sleeves and when you put it and it's got a hood as well but I don't wear the hood because it looks a bit silly and it kind of has a bit that tightens at the waist and when you pop this on it has these I think they're called like lapels which I am obsessed with completely obsessed with and it has a zip as well so you can do this up I'm going to like insert clips so you can see what they look like these things look like on and you can do this up like fully or you can do it up like halfway or just have it completely not done up and I just think this is actually perfect because the material is not super thick it's quite light and soft and this was from H&M it was a bit more expensive than other things in H&M but I think that it's just so worth it because it honestly goes with everything like it's that kind of colour that just goes with everything obsessed uh, the next thing I got is another thing from H&M. H&M has been really, really impressing me right now. And um, it's this kind of cropped, but not completely cropped, graphic top that just says, you are the ketchup to my fries, and I thought that was quite cute. And it's got, again, that grey um, material with black speckles, and it's just... It's just the most, like, the cutest thing you've ever seen in your entire life. And again, this will go really nice with the black leggings or the black shorts and it's a really really thin soft material as well so the last few things are dresses and this first dress is this dress which has a kind of paisley pattern i think this is called white and blue and i love this it's got kind of ruffle i think it's called at the bottom a bit frilly at the bottom and this is kind of like swimming costume material and this is from tommy bahama which isn't a shop I usually shop in. My mum actually bought this for me, so I have no idea. But it's that swimming costume material, as I said before, and it's got, like, most beautiful detailing on it, which I am obsessed with. And, um, yeah, love this for, like, the beach and for anywhere. So the next dress I got is this one from Forever 21, and it is this pineapple dress, and this is just a really loose throw on kind of dress and as you can see it's got the pineapples on it and just obsessed with this just black with pineapples and as I said this is just that kind of dress that you just throw on and the last piece of clothing is this other dress which is also from H&M and it looks like this it's kind of a I'm not really sure what this is called kind of dress which is really dumb because I should I think it's like a skater skirt kind of dress and it's um, striped, I think this is black, or maybe it's navy, I don't really know, and white, and it's just super nice. Again, the material's a little bit thicker on this, so you could get away with this in um, England and stuff, but I still think it's like perfect for like evenings and stuff, with some nice 
shoes, which I'm going to be moving on to now. So the first pair of shoes are these shoes, which are kind of the ugliest things, but they're just pink flip-flops, and I don't know where these are from, my mum bought these for me. And yeah, they're just plastic pink flip-flops, which are just for the beach. And the next pair of shoes I got are these ones, which are cream, and they're sandals, but they've got like a little bit of a wedge heel. And they are so nice, and they've got like a little buckle here. Again, I don't know where these are from because my mum bought them for me, but I am obsessed. And the last pair of shoes I have are these blue sandals, which are from Nine West. Again, they um, kind of have a bit of a wedge, cork wedge thing, and they are like this bright blue with a gold buckle on the toe as well as on the side. And these are just really lovely and really super comfortable. So we will be wearing those a lot. So that's kind of the end of this video. Uh, this video was actually not as long as I thought it was going to be. I got through this stuff quite quickly. Actually, once I insert the um, try-on clips, this is probably going to be a bit longer. But it's not too long, so I hope that you st are still here and stuck to the end. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And I will have more videos coming along. And I hope you enjoyed this video for like the third time now. Uh, leave a like down below if you did and um, please subscribe if you are new, which is everyone because this is a new channel. So please subscribe. I will leave everything that I can down below. Um, I'll leave my Instagram and my Twitter down below as well so you can follow me on there so you can kind of keep up to date with stuff. And I will be attempting, attempting being the, the key word here, to be vlogging in Thailand and I will be uploading those as well because vlogging is always something I've wanted to get into but then never had a YouTube channel so I could never upload it and then I'm pretty, pretty crap at vlogging if I'm going to be really, really honest. I end up vlogging for like... 10 strong minutes or not even 10 minutes like five strong minutes of vlogging and then the rest is just junk and but yeah i'm gonna really try to vlog the 10 days that we're in thailand so i hope you guys are like looking forward to that because i'm really looking forward to that and yeah this is kind of the end of this because this has got really rambly because i don't know how to shut up so yeah i will see you in my next video